Um, something that I've learned since living in Europe is that people in Europe really do look at America a lot more than I thought of. So like, they look at American media, they look at American politics, even to the extent of, I remember that when the elections were happening, um, Spanish grandfathers who were just sitting in a cafe who had never been to the States, who didn't even speak English, they were talking about the elections and talking about Trump and Hillary. And so I think that for us, we think, we don't necessarily think so much about the outside world, but a lot of the people who live in different countries, especially in Europe, they look to America for so much, especially because we're seen as like a powerhouse of a country. And so when the things like our politics and our current presidential situation, all of that stuff, we think that it only affects us, but it really affects so many other people. And you kind of hear about it all the time, even though you're not necessarily living it in the States. I'm oh, sorry, guys. <laughs> that it, I mean, it affects me because I see what's happening in the world. I mean, anything that's happening in the world is affecting everybody. And uh, it's, it's scary what's going on right now. Uh, it doesn't affect me directly because I don't have an American clients, or, but uh, I'm concerned for the rest of the world. His policies definitely affect me, maybe not in my everyday life, but it's a really big topic. Um, that I'm also discussing with friends. Um, I think it's really also an example of how global, how global the community is and how connected we all are. And yeah, I just, I'm a bit worried right now about the situation, um, especially because the states have such a big power in the world and I just hope that they, that they know what they are doing and I really hope that they are doing it for, not only their best, but also the best for, the, for all the other countries out there, because in the end, if it affects one country, it affects all the others in a kind of domino effect. Our political leaders tend to bend over backwards to appease the US in all kinds of political moves, stuff like war in Afghanistan, all that kind of thing. Um, so, uh, yeah, it really affects us. I had a lot of conversations last year with people who said things along the lines of um, I think everyone else should also get to vote in the American election. <laughs> like everyone was like, I think we should have a say in this too because it affects everyone.